I was just at this place in the city called Say Less. Yeah. This girl that I was with told <laughs> me that she was there a couple of weeks ago. She said that Donald Trump was there. So and guess sick. and guess who he was with? Uh, Future and Lil Baby. He's going to win, dude. We can't be saying this stuff out loud. Do you want him to win? No. You don't? Do you want Biden to win? Um, yeah. You want Biden to win? I thought you did too. I thought you said... My mom Biden gonna be Donald. Hey guys, I just want to say that you know, like now that Trump's leaving office, I think it's important to remember that he was the president, so we should show some respect. Pussy clot. Fuck them, Ross. Yeah, Trump. I take that back. You take it back. I've never said that before, but I officially take that back. No, this is exclusive. I yeah, don't this think is I, exclusive. I, I, I take back any positive thing I ever said about Joe Biden. Because the vaccine. That's part of it. That's a big part of it. But Trump invented the vaccine. The economy is also a big part of it. You want to elaborate? or? I mean, I don't think he should have given all that money to Ukraine. You don't think that we should have locked down or like what? I thought it was all bullshit. It was just all bullshit. I think it was but, all a scam for the pharmaceutical companies to make a ridiculous amount of money. But Trump, if you're saying that you would support him in the next election, he was... I didn't say that. Oh, okay. But you wouldn't support Biden. I did not say it either, though. Are there any marginalized communities you want to apologize to? I don't know, maybe the Pato community? Nah. I don't feel like I've truly done anything offensive, so... You don't see it as cultural appropriation. You see it as like a celebration of culture. Mm -hmm. Big up the whole island massive. It's your boy Chetana. Coming straight from the Golden Globes, you know what I'm saying? My me father told me, I'm saying, and I want to move forward, come. Big up, tune in. Big up the youth, them way out of Kingston. Me wake up this morning and me see the thing turn up. Internet gone mad. Me drop one big tune right now upon SoundCloud. Link in bio. Go listen now. Big tune. Make the thing go up. Up like seven. Up, up, up. Boop, boop, boop. Go listen now. Big tune. And then it's like social justice warriors can like go kick rocks. Yeah. 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 No comment. Got it. No, I mean, I 100% I agree. Social justice warriors can kick rocks. Mm. So, um, just checking in. Look, I've been kind of on the fence about this for a while. That's why I've never spoke on it. But with the amount of people that I know recently that, that have gotten COVID and with, like, the numbers rising, I think it's important for me to say, like, I got the vaccine. I think everybody should. I think it's really important like that we all do this just as like citizens, as Americans. We have to look out for each other and get this shit under control, guys. So like I suggest to all my followers, you guys make set an appointment and get the vaccine first thing. Psych! Bitch. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I never had COVID. You ain't sticking me with that motherfucking needle. It's the motherfucking flu. Get over it, okay? If you're sick, stay inside. I'm tired of having, okay? Why are we working around y'all? If y'all, uh, if you're in danger, stay your ass inside. I'm tired of wearing a mouth mask. I'm so sick of this mask, dude. Flipping Barnes and Noble, buying books. Sir, your mask. Oh, okay, my bad. Gotcha. I'm like, I go, I go, you're really on it, huh? He goes, uh, yeah, we are. <laughs> okay. He's like, did you get the vaccine? I'm like, yeah, yeah, for sure I got the vaccine. Psych! Bitch! <laughs> If it ain't broke, don't fix it. I never had COVID. 99% of you motherfuckers wouldn't use a shampoo that's not FDA approved, but you're willing to get some experimental government injection. Okay. Uh, <laughs> There's more evidence for UFOs being real than that uh, vaccine being healthy for you. Just saying. Uh, if the aliens are out there, I'm ready for y'all to come get me. Let's get the fuck out of here. Or am I gonna need my vaccine papers? I just got this feeling, man. Um, that this summer is, uh, it's about to be a white boy summer. Get ready, you know, because I am. just want to drop a few uh, rules and regs for uh, the white boy summer. Okay, rule number one uh, to all my white boys out there. No plaid shirts, okay? Can't be looking like a picnic table out here, boys. No calling girls smoke shows, okay? It's played out, dude. And you can't just see a hot chick and be like, dude, see smoke show, dude smoke dude okay that's over with oh yeah and anything salmon colored wardrobe burn it it's time for us to evolve okay period it's time for us to you know grow from a pikachu to a raichu hot 
boy, white boy summer. Got your favorite Instagram, rude boy. It's a white boy summer. Huh? Bad gal, white dandada. Rude boy, it's a white boy summer. That's a good Tatiana's all about a cabana. I'm out. I'm out. I'm out.